Hey everyone. So the next step in this process after you have drawn your final prairie dog drawing is if you have a piece of drawing paper or cardstock at home, you want to go ahead and um, tra either transfer or <clears throat> redraw your design onto that paper. And now I'm going to show you a way to transfer them and it's in a video that I have um, attached to this lesson, okay? After you've gotten your design onto the paper, you're gonna outline it, okay? And so if you look closely, I've outlined mine. Um, and then the next step is gonna be that you erase your pencil lines, okay? So outline with black pen and then erase <clears throat> your pencil lines. Okay, and then the next step is um, going to be coloring in, which I'm going to um, attach some videos on different um, ways that you can color your design in. Okay, also, if you have a lot of really fine details on your prairie dog, if your parents are up for it, you could buy a micron pen and um. My favorite size of Micron pen is actually a 005, and it's a really, really fine-tipped pen that you can do lots of detail work with. Now, that's only if you're up for it and they're up for buying it. They're not cheap. I think one pen is a couple of dollars. Um, <clears throat> but otherwise, you can use your Uniball waterproof pen um, for outlining. All right. Happy art making.